Hello, welcome in this video. And now here you will see a touchscreen pallet truck and we will do an equalization and calibration of this pallet truck right here. Okay, before everything, for a correct calibration procedure, we need to put a pallet, an empty pallet, over the pallet truck. So right now I will go to take an empty pallet and I will position myself again here so we can start the calibration procedure. So to enter in the setup of the scale, we need to turn off. Then again, turn on the indicator. And when the screen will show the progress bar, you can press on the upper right corner and you will enter in the technical setup. To enter in the calibration, press the first parameter. And here we are in the calibration uh, procedure. We need to go in scale one. We can go in parameter and check all the parameters for the calibration. Number of decimal, unit of measure, number of ranges, division of the first range and capacity range. These are the most important parameter for the calibration. Now we go back and we proceed with the equalization. Press here to enter the equalization. First thing, the indicator will ask if you want to execute a new equalization, confirm. And the first part, the first part of the equalization is the zero equalization. So we need to lift the fork with the pallet over it. And now I will go to do this operation. Now that the pallet is lifted, we can confirm and the indicator will acquire the zero. Okay, now we need to put the weight on the first load cell. Important thing, we, to do a correct equalization, we need a weight of at least 100 kg and the weight must be concentrated on the load cell. So this is an example of a perfect weight to do an equalization. We now proceed with the acquisition of the first load cell. Here, the indicator will show you the four load cell. The first one is blinking when the weight is on the first load cell, it's okay to acquire the first load cell weight. And now we press OK to acquire the second load cell. Now acquire the third load cell. Now acquiring the fourth load cell. Now we proceed with the calibration procedure, clicking here on calibration. The indicator will ask to insert uh, how many points after the zero. We put two points, confirm, two point, confirm. And the first thing the indicator will do the zero calibration. Now that the calibration is done, we confirm. The first weight will be 1000 kg. Now is the moment to put the weight on the scale. Press OK and confirm the first point, acquisition.
Now is second point acquisition, 2,000 kg. Confirm and load the weight. Press OK to confirm the acquisition. Now the calibration is done. To save the calibration, we need to exit from the menu, directly from here, and confirm the changes by pressing yes. As you can see, the calibration procedure is handed and the weight on the screen is correct. So, thank you for watching and if you need more help or you need more info about this type of procedure or other thing on our scales, you can contact us by phone or through the website.